We are starting with related works. Top five UGBs. One, wheelbarrow. The wheelbarrow was developed in 1970s as part of UK government's intent to deploy remote control vehicles in the battlefield. It has been used by bomb disposal squads in Northern Ireland and Iraq. The UGB's development involved a consortium of companies, including Alvis Logistics, the predecessor of Remotech UK. The NK9's enhancements have increased its speed, mobility, and payload handling capacity. In 1992, a joint venture of Alvis and Reco Electronics was awarded a contract for designing and producing a fleet of Bill Barrow MK9 for the development. Number two, Daksh by India, DRDO. Daksh is a battery operated remote controlled robot on wheels that was created with the primary function of bomb recovery. Developed by Defense Research and Development Organization, it's fully automated. Mark 5A1 is a bomb disposal robot designed by Northrop Grandman for the purpose of handling potential explosives without risking any lives. It's part of Remotec Antrus line, which includes of the robotic EODs. Harris T7. The T7 ground vehicles manufactured by Florida based on Harris are equipped with high-definition high cameras, data links, and adjustable manipulation arm, and tank-like threats. They also employ haptic feedback, which recreates the sense of robot's touch and gives an operator a better understanding of the object being diffused. They also offer vibrations and wires, or other elements of bomb, are attached by the robot to the guide the operator. Astra UGV is the first SWAM-based bomb diffusing UGV. It has motherboard and child bots. It's supported with detection units. It will also detect and diffuse landmines. If possible, machine will diffuse itself. Otherwise, user will diffuse the bomb using remote access. It's a UGV to be deployed. Stay tuned.